hi guys and welcome back to my channel it's ek if it's the first time here you're welcome if you're a subscriber thank you so much for coming back today's video is day two of our beginners makeup tutorial series today is how to groom and draw your brows for beginners and i'll also be showing you how to improvise some eyebrow products to save some coins so stay tuned while we go into this video also guys i want to let you know that brows are sisters and not twins sometimes you may get both brows looking alike and sometimes you may not so guys i'll be showing you how i grow my brows and then how i draw my brows for beginners i'll be using this gillette nasa gillette to groom my brows this is the blade i always use and this is the method that i use in grooming my brows but if you have any other method that works for you that's fine but this is how i groom my brows i'll be brushing up my brows with the spoolie so i just brush that through to see where i need to take off excess hair so i'm not taking off my hair so i'm just taking off excess hair and keeping my brow line very clean I'm doing the same thing at the top of my brows taking up excess hair as well so if you can if you notice I'm not taking off hair from my original brows so I'm just keeping the edges clean so by the way I love using half blade I'm so used to it I don't know why but it works for me I brush down my brows to see if there's any long hairs that I need to take off so I take my blade and take off any excess hair the long hairs if you can use your small scissor to trim the edges you can do that and I do the same thing by brushing up meanwhile it's not been long that I groom my brows that's why you're not seeing excess hair or long hairs so i've already groomed my brows before now so i didn't know that i'll be making this video today if not i would have left the brows a bit longer okay guys so i'm done with my grooming next i'll be applying the pons oil control i produce oil around my brows so I love to go in with this just to keep the oil at bay. Make sure you rub in the primer into your brows properly so there will be no white casts. Next is to set my brows with the Sasha Buttercup setting powder. This also helps to hold in the oil and also make my brows look natural because I love a natural looking brows so i set before i fill my brows in next i'll be filling in my brows with the hair woman brow pencil this pencil is very very affordable i said in my previous video that i'll be using very affordable products so you don't need to break the bank for you to get your makeup done i'm going to outline my brows following my natural brow line Pardon me, I don't like talking while I'm drawing my brows. So this brow pencil is in number 18. You can get this at your local store. So I'm doing the same thing at the top of my brows. So be careful, use a very light hand, do not put pressure at all on your pencil so you will not leave the brows looking very dark. So the next thing I do is to brush up my brows with a light hand as well. I give my brows a very short strokes. Make sure that your brow pencil is very sharp you always want to fill in your brows with a very pointy pencil like this so you will not leave your brows looking very dark and then it will give you that hair like strokes that you're looking for 
so with a very light hand I give it a short strokes no pressure at all so I'm just filling in the space So I brush my brows through one more time to see if there is any place that I need to fill in and then I do the same thing. I give the same short strokes. So if you notice that your pencil tip is not sharp any longer, you sharpen it again. The idea is you want your brows to come out looking very light and very nice. And you want that hair like stroke so you need to sharpen your pencil for that purpose I'll be highlighting my brows with the early girl pro concealer in fun I'll be highlighting my brows using this Bianga Beauty this is their angle brush you can use any angle brush at all or use a flat top brush like this this one goes for 2800 naira while i got this one for 1000 naira but this is my go-to angle brush for my brows anytime any day so i'll be highlighting the bottom part of my brows with the fun concealer for a beginner i feel you just need like one light shade of concealer so using not just highlighting your brow bone or your brows but also do your underneath the eyes highlights i give it a short strokes i don't go at once like outlining at once so that i'll not mess up my brows i just give it a short strokes until i get to the point that i want and then I always love to start with my brow bone. You can start anywhere from the beginning or anywhere, but I love to start with my brow bone. So I blend that out with my small blending brush. You can use your finger to blend this as well. So whichever works for you is fine. But basically I love to use my brush in blending but your finger will still give you what you want so i'll be aligning the top of my brows but this time i'm going to be using my my foundation a skin tone foundation because i don't want the top of my brows to look different from my skin when i am done with my makeup so i'm outlining with the with a skin color foundation from milani in number 11 amber I'm doing the same short strokes that I did when I highlighted my underbrows. So guys, please, if you've not subscribed yet to my channel, this is a good time to subscribe because this is a series. I'm going to be giving you videos back to back and then like i said in my first video if you've not watched that yet i'll be leaving the link in my description box so you go check out what we had on our first day this is day two i'm gonna be giving you tips and tricks and i also said i'll be showing you how to improvise for your products because sometimes you have one particular product that can work for something else but you don't know how to use it or you even have it right now you're not making use of it and then you're thinking how am i gonna get it that's the reason why i said this video is a very beginners friendly you not you do not need to break the bank for you to get yourself glammed up just go what you can follow from the beginning this series is going to be very fun and very very interactive so let me know your thoughts for this series down in the comment section let me know what you want me to be putting up so please subscribe and also give this video a thumbs up please share with your friends tell them to come watch this series because it's going to be very very informative so i blend out as well you want your brows to look smashed and look well 
highlighted so you need to blend the edges blend the concealer or foundation into your skin properly so it will not look harshy and then give you that hello look so guys i'm going to brush the beginning part of my brows because i want this area to look very natural and like a transition if you notice this area looks very light because i didn't feel this area too much so that i'll be able to brush out and make it look very natural so guys i said in my previous videos that and in my previous video that i'm going to be showing you how to improvise this is edge control instead of using a brow tamer okay brow tamer is about um 3500 naira depending on the brand that you want to purchase but this particular one is 700 naira i'll be putting the price in dollars so you know so i want to tame my brows and just make it stay put all through the day so i'm using this to brush my brows I use the tail of my uh, spoolie and then just press my brows down this will also help you to dry down quickly i don't know if you're noticing the difference already between these brows and this let me come closer so you see the difference between these brows and this one you see that this one is properly laid i love the way it's looking but it's looking a little bit dark like i said i love natural looking brows so instead of me using a brow tint or if you don't have you don't need to you don't need to worry at all i have this brow tint from milani and then i have this from blood cosmetics but i'm not gonna use any of this remember i said i'm going to be improvising so that you know you save some coins all right so i'm going to be taking my concealer the one i used previously in highlighting my brows just to make my brows look a little bit natural so i'll be taking that on my spoolie I just put that at the back of my hand and then I brush my brows through yes are you noticing the difference guys that's how I do if I don't want to use my brow tint you don't need to worry your head at all just use your concealer and get the job done okay so yeah guys that is it for this video thank you so much for watching if you got any value out of this video don't forget to give this video a huge thumbs up leave a comment below and also don't forget to subscribe right here and ring the bell beside it so you don't miss new videos thank you so much for watching stay tuned stay blessed and stay beautiful till i come your way next time bye guys